Hi, in this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to use OneDrive Files Restore to help you recover from accidental or malicious changes to your OneDrive. Uh, so let me start by going here uh, in this uh, web interface. I'm going to go to the Documents folder and I'm going to make a few changes to OneDrive. So I could actually make these changes um, in the local uh, disk of my PC and let sync. Uh, take it to the cloud, or I can do it in a in an office application, or maybe even mobile apps. Uh, but here to keep things simple, I'm going to use uh, the browser, the the web version of OneDrive. So I'm going to go ahead and make a few changes here. I'm going to create a folder. Let's call this folder uh, Finance, and I'm going to move a few. Um, Excel files to it. Maybe I'm going to multi select here and move these to finance. So that's good. I moved a few of those. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, select a few. Let's do a few presentations. You're going to get this presentation, this one, and this one. And I'm going to delete them. Um, oh, there's one more here. I'm going to delete that one as well. So uh, what I'm doing here is I'm making changes, right? And uh, let's suppose that I want to go ahead and revert those changes. Maybe those were accidental changes, someone just made a mistake, or maybe it was attacked by ransomware and those were malicious changes that just they're just messing up my OneDrive. So I'm going to go ahead here to this cogwheel and select options. And you will see there is now a new option here called restore your OneDrive. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And uh, I'm going to start here by selecting a custom date and time. I could go back to yesterday. That's probably that probably do it for me. But I'm going to select custom uh, date and time. So uh, what you're seeing here is that we now have this thing that we call the activities list. And uh, the activities list shows everything that happened uh, recently in your OneDrive. So you can see, for instance, that I have uh, deleted the PowerPoints, that I have moved the Excel spreadsheets, and I have added this folder called Finance. So if I want to go back to how things were before we did all this, what I would do is just click here and uh, select uh, the moment when I created the Finance folder. So uh, keep in mind that what we're doing here, right? We're selecting a point in time. I, I could actually go to the recycle bin and recover some of these files from there, or maybe move the files manually myself. But by selecting this point in time and saying restore, I am basically uh, asking OneDrive to automatically do all uh, of this, to undo all these operations uh, on my behalf. So I'm go ahead and click on restore and then confirm and what OneDrive is going to do is going to go through that activity list and uh, revert it each action one by one right so it's going to go ahead and complete so it's done I'm going to go here back to my OneDrive and go to the documents folder and what you see is that all my PowerPoints are back. And you also see that the uh, Excel files uh, were uh, put back in place and the finance folder is gone, right? There is no more finance folder, right? So um, I'll actually go uh, back here. I'm going to click on the options and go back to the OneDrive file restore page again to look at the activities. and. Uh, let me go here and select custom date and time again and look at this activity list. So uh, 
what you're going to see here, right, is uh, you see that the restore action actually brought uh, some folders. If you look here, it started actually around here. So you have a number of restores from the recycle bin that those are the PowerPoints that we deleted, then that's how you bring them back. You restore them from the recycle bin. And then you see moves associated with the spreadsheet. So the spreadsheets were moved from finance back to documents. And then finally, you see the delete of the finance documents. So, uh, and, and uh, the way we do this, we keep track of these things. And you could even here in this say, I want to go back to how things were before the restore. So we call that the back to the future scenario. But the important thing to notice here is that OneDrive actually keeps track of all these activities and will restore you back to that exact uh, point in time. So in summary, this was a demonstration of how OneDrive files restore can help you recover from accidental or maybe malicious changes to your OneDrive, including uh, ransomware attacks. Thank you.